Oh yeah, I forgot I'm wearing this sweet fucking dress. Shit. No messages for you, Commander. I'm gonna lose this when I go somewhere else. Plus 13 hours. Yeah, I guess, but I'm not gonna do, um, like, math. <laughs> it's way easier to go <laughs> to say what I said in my head. Um, the ass suit? Well, I don't have it on right now because I'm not on a mission. Can you mod the game for that dress to be default? I fucking wish. Probably. You're on a train to Osaka. Hey, nice. That's awesome. Um... But yeah, game mods are super weird in this game because, like, you have to apply all of them and then the texture mods. So I'd have to, like, reapply all the patches again from the ground up. Can you mod the game to replace that dress with the ass suit during the fancy party? Pro probably! Now I get to play, how do I control this game? Commander. I assume everything's going well up here. Good for now. Ugh, Fractured same my thing. thumb on the mute, but I think I made it. That's my... it for now. See you, Commander. Bye. <laughs> Thank you, Wintermute. <laughs> How are you doing tonight? Is your PlayStation stuff still fucked? Uh let's go. Okay. I don't know why I walked around there. <laughs> there was no reason for me to do that. There was nothing there for me. Oh, okay. Why am I so fancy? I, w I w went to a party in the last game, last stream. Just wanted to slam your boobs into Kelly. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, that's what we, we decided we were gonna help Thane and Garrus. So I thought I already helped Thane, but I guess I didn't. Okay, I can't- apparently this is a mission I can fuck up. So, hopefully let's not do that. We're, we'll have to reload. <laughs> Help Thane and Garrus get lost. <laughs> I like Gary, though. Let's go... here. Oh, it's at the Citadel, okay. This area is fucking huge, though. Better play less 24 hours back up this USB stick that just had to be formatted EXT4. What format is that? Is it like a format you can't like easily you uh like SSTKOUOO3? It's time oh, to hand Ty Shepard okay. show into today's episode. I assume you don't have a computer running Linux right now then. Uh it's time for Hentai Shepard. <laughs> Kerry. Please I don't remain know. seated until the Normandy comes to a complete stop. Your stewardess will direct you to the exits. Gosh. Oh, hell yeah. We got two new loyalty things here. Okay, so I maybe I should take both Garrus and Thane because they will trigger the mission. Or whoever I get to first will do their mission. Uh. Okay, what do I do? Slam! W enter mute. In the event of a water landing, the exits are here and back there by the wing. <laughs> Destroyer or oh. Your weapon inflicts more damage and you receive a damage bonus to biotic powers, or your stain power lets you survive marathons of combat. I feel like the the other one's a cooler one, but I think I need to do this one. Power recharging time and Paragon Renegade scores are all improved, and you receive a bonus to biotic power duration. I think I should get this one. Yeah, let's go. Oh god, auto level up. <laughs> 
W enter mute. Your seat cushion can be used as a flotation device, but really, you're going to be farting in it most of the trip. Do you really want to float on that? <laughs> Kerry. In an emergency, a mask will drop down from the compartment above you, secure it around your face and breathe normally, then help the passenger next to you with as the stewardess will demonstrate. This is too real. I was just on plane, <laughs> like, last week. Okay, you know, I'm gonna keep everything I have on right now. I found references to. I know who the last crew member is. Crime report, um. Perhaps that is a good place to start. No looking. spoilers. Also, according to CSEC, a drill recently passed through customs. The CSEC office may Carry. have more information. Hooray for the throuple mission! <laughs> what? Oh, okay, hold on. Thank you, Great Newtons, for the hint about, um, what not to fuck up during this mission. Okay, I totally didn't pay attention to what, um, this W enter mute. The flight time for today is going to be one Every and a half hours, so no meal for you. Enjoy your tiny packet of peanuts and half a can of soda. Of light speed. Man, I didn't get anything on my last flight. It was all, like, you had to pay for everything. Except for, like, water, I think? Sucked. Okay, I- okay, so the problem is when I landed on this planet, I didn't pay attention to what they said to do. Uh, and this area is fucking huge ass. Like... Where the fuck do I go? <laughs> Did anyone catch where I had to go? I'm just gonna look this up. <laughs> Kerry. Fucking huge ass. I will be an adult and leave it where it lay. <laughs> SSGKOU003. Please don't panic and leaving effectively order. <laughs> w enter mute. Excuse me, I'm huge ass. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, this is like an entire. Okay, I'm trying to look for like his loyalty mission, but I'm just getting like his entire history. <laughs> Where? Okay, this is way too much information. Way too much information. Mass <laughs> effect to loyalty mission Thane entrance. Carry. Come on, Wiki. Crime doesn't need his Tinder profile. <laughs> Just give the outline. Exactly. <coughs> um, CSEC. Okay. W so enter mute. Too much information as in a whole walkthrough with him, or too much information like his measurements. Yeah, flaccid and like erect. the latter. Um, there were like comics and like his entire history through all the entire Mass Effect universe. It was a lot. It was a lot of stuff. It's too much information. There's not what I was looking for. Um, so CSEC, I believe, is, like, right inside this door, so let's just go. You'll have to wait for the next shuttle. You made me miss the last one. You needed to go. You'd think Citadel security would be the tightest in the galaxy. I know CSEC too well to believe that's true. Hell yeah, Gary. I see no fewer than 14 fatal flaws a skilled assassin could exploit. Eight of them existed when I was here ten years ago. W enter mute. The latter, so you know how big he is flaccid and erect. <laughs> yeah, that's what it says. Your leg is real, oh man. How is the internet? If you're able to, like, at least tune in a bit, you're on, like, a train, right? Yes. Um. Oh, I need both of these, okay. There we My go. Let's do things trying first. to find his son. We think a local criminal may have hired him. That should be easy. We don't see many drell here. Guy is fracking Baltar. There we go. One of my men reported a drill recently. And he was talking to Mouse. Interesting. Mouse? Ah, uh, petty I criminal. Like Probably not the guy who hired your boy, but a messenger. He's a former duct rat. Runs errands for anyone who'll pay. What sort of trouble has Mouse been getting himself into? Odd jobs for shifty people. 
Ducked rats take whatever is available to get by. Data running, fencing stolen goods, w selling interviews. illegal VI Which guy is Falter? The original or the Actually, reboot? he was selling one of you. I'm talking Me. about the yeah, reboot. Yeah, when you erased a file, it would say, I delete data like you on the way to real errors. That's pretty extreme, <laughs> Commander. Laugh it up, Garrus. <laughs> Buggy, though. It crashed every half hour. The error message was about how the galaxy was at stake and you should fix the problem yourself. Uh, but yeah, no, this guy's voice actor plays Colonel Ty from, uh, Battlestar Remake. Better than Via Rail. Oh my god, Terry. the Via Rail internet and is fucking Thane garbage. And as Thane met the gaze of his lover with his cold dead eyes, their passion flared, oh and they god. spent the next several hours in sizzling so ultra fornication so ardent it would make even the most experienced Asari blush purple. This is what I imagine you got in your search results. What was it you yep. called, Mouse? A duct rat. It's a local slang for the poor kids who grow up in the station. Oh my god. When they're small, they tend to play in the ventilation ducts where adults can't get to them. Aren't That's the safe? ducks dangerous? Every couple of months, we pull a little body out of them. Lacerated by fan blades, broken by a deadfall, uh. suffocated by vacuum exposure. Those are just the ones we know about. More just disappear. Maybe they get sucked into space. Maybe they fall into the protein vats the keepers run. Uh. The mouse survived long enough that he can't fit in the ducts anymore. He was one of the smarter ones, or the luckier ones. Okay. I've heard enough. Mouse is usually upstairs outside the Dark Star. He works out of a public comm terminal. Dark you should Star. pick up a okay. copy of the Shepherd VI when you talk to him. It sounds like your boy's running with the wrong crowd. Yes, I agree. If Mouse can't get you in touch with your son directly, he'll know who can. I'll help you if you need it. You don't know us, Captain. Why are you going so far to help us? I've worked at Kara for two years. Every day kids turn to crime because they've got no other choice. Because their parents don't care. You're trying to save yours. He faces a dark path. Oh shit. Oh, I thought he was gonna go into one of his, uh, asides. <laughs> eat kids, eat kids. God damn it. Let's we get started. Hurry, then. We have to go there ourselves? You didn't tell him that Kolyat plans okay. to assassinate someone. Um, he's a cop. They try to stop Kolyat, and one of them could end up dead. I don't want that. How are you doing tonight, Ignorant Spoon? Yes, of course. Thank you, Shepard. Dark Star on the upper market level. Okay. Oh, God. Wait, shit. Oh, yeah. Is it this way? Oh, my God. That's the complete opposite way of what I'm facing. Welcome. Nope, I didn't want this to talk to you. This is the oh, Ward Trans. The Alliance Embassy has issued a oh, travel advice. That's all for now. Thank you for using Avena. Have a pleasant day. Okay, it's this way. <laughs> no, why would you tell him that? <laughs> he didn't need to know. <laughs> He's got 2.7 BMU bad man units. Thank you for that, Carrie. <laughs> I was sitting there waiting to see what BMU stood for. <laughs> Do you have an account with us? If you open one. You can download a game Darks free. is right out. Oh. Who am I talking to here? Is it you? No. I say outside the Dark Star Lounge. What did that thing say? Under Codex? No, this isn't it either. Okay. 
near the Dark Star on the upper market level. Okay. This is the entrance to the Dark Star, right? Just see who I can talk to, I guess. Stay hydrated, everyone. Do I have water? I do. Bring some water. Oh, the command is exclamation mark H2O. For the stay hydrated, uh... Command. The worst thing about extranet games is when some Batarian comes on and insists on speaking his own language without auto-translation. <laughs> okay, I can't talk to you. Um, oh, there he is. Yeah, yeah, I can get that. No problem. Well, okay, that might be more difficult. No, no, it's fine. I got some quarians who can strip the copy Stay protection. Hydrated. Yeah, sure. I can um, get you two but yeah, no, I love that day. command in you your mouse? chat. It's very good. You... Oh, shit. Krios. I thought you retired. Commander Shepard? I, I thought you died. What do you want with me? Be still, Mouse. You can change your pants in a moment. How do you know Thane? Krios? He didn't... If he didn't say nothing, I ain't either. When we heard the name, I didn't think it could be the same mouse. He was a contact on the Citadel when I was active. He and some other children would gather information on my targets. You put children in danger to spy for you? Children, the poor. My people's word for their kind is Dralafa, the ignored. They're everywhere, see everything. Yet they are never seen. You gave another Drell instructions for an assassination. Who's the target? I, I don't know. I didn't ask. Because the people I work for? We don't have time for this. Oh, God, Thane, help me. How did you do the renegade help thing? Help me, Mouse. My son is out there, in the dark. That's my... <laughs> Sugoi Corp and Party of Three, he welcome! In, said he was for How work. are you doing? He had a hollow can we get a shout out? You took, do we have any mods I that can do a shout out right now? Old contacts. Elias wanted to hire him. Elias Kellum. Thank you. Minecraft, nice. Are you playing vanilla Minecraft or modded Minecraft? But the One other thing. VIs. That Shepard VI you're selling? Oh shit, you hurt. Look, you were dead. It was totally legal to make a VI of you. You made money using my likeness. I think I deserve some of the profits. Don't you? Oh, sure. How about I just transfer some money to you? Give me that I mean, cash. Why bother with all the lawyers and taxes and junk, huh? Tell me about Kellum. Human. Moved to the Citadel about ten years ago. He was little people when you were here, Krios. He got big after the Geth attack. Lots of the big guys from before got cacked, all in them big fancy apartments up on the Presidium. Now he runs the rackets on the lower end of the ward. Shin Akiba. He's seriously bad news. Fruit punch is an industry mix. Pineapple, passion fruit, apricot, papaya, guava, and apple. That's a lot of different fruits. That definitely sounds like a good fruit punch. Um, okay. I don't want to apologize for it. Okay, no, we're going to... Fuck. You just saved yourself a world of pain, kid. Yeah, right. When Kellen finds out what I've done, I won't live long. And I can't do anything about it but hide. Krios, you got any kindness for me? Put a bullet in Kellen before you go. Couldn't have been easy. Mouse knew more about my life than Kolyat ever did. He smiles up at me, broken oh, teeth and goes. scabby knees. Bare feet black. A dead end future looking up at me, worshipping the petty gifts I offer. I was the only good thing he had back then. But I left him as I left Kolyat. Mouse said you had a hollow of him. Yes. 
A foolish bit of sentimentality. I can perfectly recall every moment I spent with Mouse. Of course you can. He pulls at my arm, smiles. He wants to know that I'll remember him, that anyone will remember him. I take the hollow. He smiles at himself in miniature on my palm. Then a frown crinkles his brow. He pats my pockets, checking for other hollows. Where's your son, Krios? He asks. <laughs> this is mean. Don't blame yourself. If I don't, who will? We must carry the weight of our decisions, Shepard. SSGKOU003. Let's head back to Bailey. Hentai shaking down people down for money. How low has she fallen? I gotta be renegade. I don't get the complaints about the Grim Terminus Alliance. Where is Bailey? Where's Bailey? Hold on. Is Bailey the cop? So what if you can capture and beat slaves? It's just a game. Oh no. That was awful. I think so, right? I think he is. Let's go. W enter mute. Bailey was PT, Barnum's partner. How do I get here? I don't see the walls. And all the way this way? Oh god. It's down no, I have to go back. Yeah, Captain C set Captain Bailey. That is him. Is it here? There he is. Yes? Can we talk about my associate's son? You talked to Mouse? Did you get the name of the guy he's working with? Elias Kellum. Kellum? Oh, shit. Ah, look, this is awkward. Kellum and I have a, an agreement. He doesn't cause too much trouble and buys tickets to the CSEC charity ball from me in return. Mm. I ignore him. You want to accept bribes? Fine. I don't care how you run your precinct. I want to know if you're going to help me. Yeah, I'll help. Absolutely. I'll get some of my people to bring him in and set him up in a private room. You can interrogate him yourself. I'll stay out of sight. And if fuck I'm lucky, police. Kellum will believe that I had nothing to do with it. Bring him in. We might not have much time. I'll make it happen. Wait here. We've got Kellum. Tell Bailey we're ready. He'll expect me to get him out of this. Not today, I think. Captain, his lawyer's here. Bet Elias has his VI set to page him if CSEC gets within 10 meters. I'll stall him. Get in there and work fast. We should question him together. Keep the pressure on. Thoughts on how we approach it? Hmm... Convince him that we'll put a bullet in his head if he doesn't talk. Once he's scared, he'll cooperate. Very well. I'll pretend we're ready to kill him. We can't push too hard, though. We need the information more than we need a corpse. Get me out of these restraints, Bailey. Pretty funny bringing me down here like this. The hell are you two? Here we go. Guess I'm good cop. It's me, good cop. Oh shit. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. You ordered a hit on someone. You're gonna tell me who. AKA cops. The only person I'm talking yep. to is my advocate. Here's how it works. I ask a question, you answer the question. You speak when you're spoken to. Who the fuck do you think Mr. you are? Mr. Kellum, I don't believe you were paying attention. Nice. You just handed me your job. Hit me again and I'll take your money yeah. too. 
I'm gonna straighten you out. As soon as Bailey gets here. Bailey isn't here. We are. You're dealing with us. Got it? What are you, frog boy? Her little apologist. The fuck? What, kid? You gonna bore me into confessing? You ain't shit. Working for me. No! Do you know what I'll do to you when I get out of here? Keep it up, tough guy. You'll leave in a bag. Go to hell. He's up. He's no use to us dead. Are we done here? Because I You're got fine. people to see. I'm done being patient. Give me a name or I'll cut your balls off and sell oh, no. them to Krogan. Joram! Joram Talid. Dorian in the 800 blocks. There we go. He's unconscious. No need to wake him up, I think. I'm not shedding any tears. Not over the likes of him. I'd hope to avoid unnecessary bloodshed. Pure results come from pure methods. I worry about what is yet to come. Okay. What's the story? Why'd Kellum hire the boy? Assassination. A Turian named Joram Talid. You know him? Joram? Yeah. You might have seen his posters around. He's promising to end organized crime on the ward. Thing is, his message is all mixed up in race politics. W enter me. human. I think you should cut off his balls and sell them to a Krogan anyway. Yeah, right? Anti-human. Are so bad that people can openly campaign as anti-human? You haven't heard what the aliens have been saying? They think the Council died because our fleet refused to save them. That we stacked the new Council with humans and yes-men. Anderson does his best to be diplomatic, but they act like we're jackbooted thugs enforcing a coup. I don't give a damn what Joram's politics are. This is about Thane's son, not him. You might not care, but the people who live here do. Sergeant, get a patrol car. These two need to get to the 800 blocks. Yes, sir. Okay. Let's go shoot shit. And hopefully not die with our new upgrade. Hope it was a good choice. See how much stronger I am. Kerry. For a minute I thought that Sergeant was cute until I realized she's a cop this. Fuck the police. Fallen to lead on the maintenance catbox. Tell me what he's doing. The Krogan bodyguard will make him easy to follow. Where will you be? The darkest corner with the best view. Kerry. Hashtag fuck the police hashtag not literally. Lord of hunters. <laughs> Grant that my hands be steady, my aim be true, and my feet swift. And should the worst come to pass. Grant me forgiveness. Disappear. It's been Wait, wonderful talking with you all. What? I hope you'll come out on election. W enter me. Hashtag so fuck the won't get their way. <laughs> I will. And I'll do it through legal processes, not by a coup attempt. And don't forget, my friends, there are treasonous elements in our own house. The humans seize power by oof. themselves, but they can't hold on to it without the support of the lesser races. This doesn't stop here. I won't rest until the humans have been removed from power. Other races wait patiently for hundreds or thousands of years to earn an embassy. Do the humans? No! They conveniently show up right after the Council's been killed. They surround us with warships. They dictate terms. That's not how we do things. We respect tradition. Humans think anything ten years old is obsolete. Worthless. How can they contribute to a 2,000-year-old government? Have we seen anything good since the humans moved into Zakara Ward? <laughs> I like their food. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have to take your word for that. I can't eat human food. But let's be serious. Since the Shinakiba Enclave opened, crime has increased. Incidents of racial tension are up 24%, despite 116 new CSEC officers assigned to the ward. Of course, most of those officers aren't Turians, or Salarians, or Asari. They're humans who turn a blind eye to the crimes of other humans. That corruption goes all the way to the top. 
Don't think a human with a C-Sec has a lot to say. Badge is any less a crook than the thugs he deals with. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. You can count on it. I'm on him, Fane. He's talking to some voters. Understood. You're in position? Yes. Kay. It's been wonderful talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. I'm following. This looks interesting. Where is he? Looks like he's talking to another voter. Any sign of Cole yet? No. I'm moving to another position. Ahead of him. Okay, this is time. It's been wonderful thing. talking with you all. I hope you'll come out on election day. Uh oh. Oh shit. Where'd he go? Fuck. I fucked up. No problem so far. I don't know what he looks like. He's not like highlighted, right? Got him. Target in sight. He's the only one moving. Okay. Yep, that's true. This music. What's he doing? I don't have a good angle. What's he doing? One of his guards is talking to the bartender. Looks like a shakedown. I'm relocating to the next room. Let me know if anything changes. Target in sight. Okay, where is he? Did he not come in here? I see him. Yes, sir. Do I? You're running for office. He's meeting a couple of mercenaries. Looks like the same group his bodyguard comes from. He looks nervous. Could be he's noticed you. Maybe he saw Kolyad in here somewhere. Also a possibility. There are obstructions ahead. I'll try to go around. Don't lose him. Don't lose him? Someone's walking on my grave. We're thinking about it. Yes, sir. For this. <laughs> Oof. Sorry, dude. Oh, hey, Plum! How are you doing? Cole yet. Thanks for stopping by. This... this is a joke. 
Now? Now you show up. Help me, Drell. I'll do whatever you want. c -Sec. Put the gun down, son. Get out of my way. I'm walking out. He's coming with me. They'll have snipers outside. I don't need your help. What the hell? D Talib, get the hell out of here. Yeah, yeah, I will. Take the boy into custody. You son of a bitch! Mm. Your father and I have killed a lot of people. You haven't. There's no reason you should start. I read his files. What made it all right for him to kill all those years? I was six when the Hanar began to train me. I didn't know any better. Your mother woke me from my battle sleep. Then why did you leave her? Why weren't you there when she died? Your mother. They killed her to get to me. It was my fault. What? After her body was given to the Deep, I went to find them. The Trigger Men. The Ringleaders. I hurt them. Eventually killed them. When I went back to see you, you were... Older. I should have stayed with you. I guess it's too bad for me you waited so long, huh? Kolyat, I've taken many bad things out of the world. You're the only good thing I ever added to it. This isn't a conversation you should have in front of strangers. <laughs> Boys, take Kolyat and his father back to the precinct. Give them a room and as much time as they need. I'm surprised you're letting him do that. You think he's the only man who ever screwed up raising a son? I have to get back to the precinct. Come on, I'll give you a lift. I get to choose any other options there? Thinking I should be in bed, but I don't wanna. Uh, if you're sleepy, you should go to sleep. But I appreciate you being around in the meantime. Uh, reboot Balter is Alucard on the next book's Castlevania. Yes, I did know that. You can totally tell it's him. <laughs> okay. We did it. This is happening. They're still been talking. In there a while. Uh, the kid's been through a lot. I ran some searches in the CSAC archive. About ten years back, a bunch of real bad people were killed. Like someone was cleaning house. The prime suspect was a drill. We never caught him. Someone like that is trouble you don't want to deal with. Someone's got to deal with it. Doesn't have to be me, though. Yeah, don't you fucking dare. How'd it go? Our problems are... They aren't something I can fix with a few words. We'll keep talking, see what happens. Your boy shot some people. No one I feel sympathy for, but there it is. Oh, it's such an asshole move to do this. Here we go, renegade! That kid goes through the system, we both know he's there for the rest of his life. Those guys were a waste of skin, scales, whatever. If you've got another suggestion, I'm listening. Give him a job. He can work off his debt to society and you can keep an eye on him. It sounds like more work for me, and I can't just deputize him into CSEC. You have to go through channels. I didn't say have him work for CSEC. I said have him work for you. Interesting. I'll think about it. Okay, that Thank wasn't you, as much of a jerk option as I thought it would be. I only got plus five renegade for that. Yes. 
I'm trying to find a local forger. He goes by the name of Fade. Yeah, I know him. The alias, anyway. I've He's definitely been a thorn in the network M division before. side for the last year. He works with the Blue Suns. Where can we find him? <laughs> if I knew that, he'd be in a cell. Best I can do is put you on the trail. There's a warehouse in the marketplace. Some of Fade's contacts work out of there. Go ask them some questions. Gently, of course. Why haven't you been able to catch him? Whoever he is, he's damn good at avoiding CSEC. I think someone on the inside's feeding him information. Either that, or he's got access to our databases and comm channels. I don't know which is worse. But you're outside CSEC. Maybe you can nail his ass. Yeah, I'll nail I his ass. I should be going. You need anything else? Let me know. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Warehouse. All the way over there. Okay, so to my left. Wait, to my left. Here. W enter mute. Freezing. <laughs> right? Uh. Is it down? I guess it's down, right? That makes sense. Straight ahead. This looks like the play. Wait, this was a trick, wasn't it? You sent me to the wrong place just to get me to leave. I wouldn't know anything about that. I've been trying to get this refund for two years. Two years! I'm not giving up now. You'd get a lot farther in life if you just held on to your service orders and receipts. Okay, so I'm assuming this is it. I should save. I haven't done that in like since the beginning of the game. Um, um, I will be right back. I'm going to grab some more water and I'm going to grab a snack. Pause here. Actually, we can just stay in this hallway and flex. <laughs> be right back. <laughs>
Today's snack is a lemon poppy seed loaf. It's really good. <laughs> I got this today. It's almost gone now. Love this stuff. Okay. <laughs> Super soft, too. It's, like, really good. Okay. Mission time. Fade? You're not quite how I imagined you. Looks can be deceiving. So, which one of you wants to disappear? I'd rather see you make someone reappear. Ah, uh, that's not the service we provide. Make an exception. Just this once. Damn it! Quick! Shoot them! Shoot them, you love them! It's too fucked. slow. Why do I even bother? We need to find a client of yours. I suggest you cooperate. Wait. I'm not the one you want to talk to. I'm not Fade. I knew it. Well, then maybe you'd like to tell us where to find him. Yes, of course. He's in the factory district. Works out of the old prefab boundary. I know the place. Oh, he's got a lot of mercs there. Blue Suns. Harkin thinks they're protecting him. Harkin. <laughs> My guy here needs some decongestants. <laughs> yep. What do the Blue Suns have to do with this? Did they use his services? To help their people infiltrate Sounds like everyone had Wendy's today except for me. Here on the Citadel. Bastard. He's using CSEC to help those scum. Uh, no, no, no. Well, not really. He got fired from CSEC. Oh, it wasn't Wendy's. Oh, okay, ago. I assumed it was Wendy's. I thought that's why the Wendy's chat assistance. started earlier. Interesting. But it changes nothing. We still need to find him before we can get to Sedonis. This Harkin sounds like he could use a little talking to. Talk all you want. I'll be too busy giving his kidneys a friendly thumping. We'll need to go to the transit station. Nice. I can get us to him from there. So I, uh... I can go? Sure, but if we don't find Harkin, we'll be back for you. Oh. Good. <laughs> Wendy's chat came up because it was one of casual slam gems and courage options. Oh, okay. I see. And Gary, you're so cool. Oh, hey, Thane's there too. <laughs> ah, got it. Okay, where are we going? Oops. Wait, where actually are we? Ooh. Wasn't paying attention where we had to go next. Here we go. Garrus eye for an eye. Hail a cab. Take a cab to the factory where Harkin is hiding out. Okay. How do we know which... which okay. I just got a refund in exchange and I was told to pick up a new offer. That rapid transit? Murder here. I don't think you have the right plate. Factory district, there we go. <laughs> Saving children. <laughs>
Okay, uh, we're gonna take Garrus and Let's take Morden. Great Newtons, are you here? I'm taking Morden. Find you, bitch. Get ready to fight. Deploying neural shock. Oh. Nice shooting. Thanks, Gary. He probably wasn't was talking to Morden, not me. remember what button that was. Kerry. I don't want to do body Geraldo's skin. cousin Valentina. I'm shocked you DIDNT murder them. Uh Logan who already tried to escape my base but my terrorist group connected and we just stole them back. <laughs> oh my god. Space kitty. Okay, I, I know I want that one. I feel like this one is not great. I'm gonna switch it to this. Let's go left bumper, X. Okay. Actually, I can just activate that one. So let's put this on one on right bumper. Okay. Let's try to use my biotics a bit more. Rerouting power. Thanks. 
A wall save. We get to bypass the thing. Hell yeah. Sister. I fucking love shitty mini games like this. <laughs> like the match mini games. <laughs> Arkin's in here somewhere. I can smell him. Are you making a Fifth Element reference? Because I still haven't seen that movie! I was gonna watch it when I was in the States, but it turns out that Netflix in the States doesn't have it. It does in Canada. Please hack now. Okay, let me grab these. UP laser guns, hell yeah. Hey Jonathan Ray. How you doing? I did fucking lose the ability to hack that. I'm so mad. Oh wait, wait, wait. Oh my god, did they just get into another fight? Holy shit, I gotta do this fast. W enter mute. Stay clear of the Blue Sun's Legionnaires. They carry Legionnaires' disease. What is Legionnaires' disease anyway? I just realized I don't actually know. I probably have heard what it is before, but I forgot. Since then. I'm sure I've looked it up before. Cells. Kerry. Legionnaire's disease, also known as Legionellosis, is a form of atypical pneumonia caused by any type of Legionella bacteria. Signs and symptoms oh, okay. include cough, shortness of breath, high fever, muscle pains, and headaches. Nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea may also occur. So it's like permanent flu? The fuck? Watching crime slaughter mothers and fathers that do mercenary work Apparently, for very, 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 very has a tab open to Wikipedia also. <laughs> Thanks for looking it up, everyone. 
getting close. this. Days after exposure, the fatality rate of Legionnaire's disease has ranged from 5 to 30 percent during various outbreaks and approaches 50 percent for nosocomial infections, especially when treatment with antibiotics is delayed. Hospital-acquired Legionella pneumonia has a fatality rate of 28 percent, oh, wow. and the principal source of infection in such cases is the drinking water distribution system. Oh, interesting. That's weird. The disease is named after the outbreak where it was first identified in 1976 at the American Legion Convention uh, in Philadelphia. Falling asleep? Yeah, it's just, everyone's kind of sleepy today. Really low energy. Pretty sure everyone has told me that they're super sleepy today. <laughs> Myself included. I'm pretty sleepy, too. W enter mute. Let's just call it a day. <laughs> it's a day. Yeah, it's a day. Definitely a day. But the weather was, like, super nice here today. Like, I had a, a really, like, it was really nice outside. It was full of beans over here for some reason. What does that mean? What does that expression mean? And switch ground. This is the bottom one. This one, this one, and this one. Lots of energy. Ah! Yeah, I was like, I, I did so much shit today. Like, I did so much stuff. I'm just, I think that's why I'm so exhausted. Kerry. The bacterium is found naturally in fresh water. It can contaminate hot water tanks, hot tubs, and killing oh. towers of large air conditioners. It is usually spread by breathing oh, in mist that contains the bacteria. It can also occur when contaminated water is aspirated. It typically does not spread directly between people, and most people who are exposed do not become infected. Is it like a, um... Like a not a common thing that happens? Or that people get? You worked with Harkin at CSEC? Yeah, he was a pain in the ass back then, too. But I'm in no mood for, for anyone wondering, games. they're talking about Legionnaire's disease. Him which I didn't know what it life. was, so now I know. You seem to be getting tense, Garrus. Harkin may know why Sedonis wanted to disappear. If so, he knows why we're here, and I don't want him tipping Sedonis off. Kerry. Risk factors for infection include old age, a history of smoking, chronic lung disease, and poor immune function. 
Those with severe pneumonia and those with pneumonia and a recent travel history should be tested for the disease. I saw something. Diagnosis He's is by a urinary antigen test and sputum culture. Sputum. I think I drank too many coffees, my Kerry. beans, yeah. An estimated 8,000 to 18,000 cases a year in the United States oh, require okay. hospitalization. Hmm. You probably already have it, but are immune to it type of thing. Interesting. Well, I learned a bunch today <laughs> about Legionnaire's disease. What are you gonna do to Harkin if he won't cooperate? He's a real criminal now, working for the Blue Suns. I should just shoot him on sight. But I need him alive, so I won't do any permanent damage. Cut his balls off just and sell him to the Krogans. Just enough to his tongue. Whatever it takes. Exactly. I knew you'd understand. He's still planning to kill Sedonis when we That's find him? It'll be more than he deserves, but as long as he's dead, oh. I'll be satisfied. It was the same thing, right? Wait, was it? What are you gonna do to Harkin? He's a butt. I need him alive, so I won't do oh, any okay. permanent damage. Just enough to loosen his tongue. Now, did it switch to dialogue? To That's a, it'll be more than he deserves, but as long as he's dead, I'll be satisfied. I got no problem with that. Somehow, I didn't think you would. Basically the same response. What do you think Harkin's got waiting for us in there? Not sure. It looks like an industrial complex. Heavy machinery. Could be anything. Something's in there. Probably more blue suns. Harkin's kind of trapped himself in a corner. He must have something in store for us. Do you think he'll be satisfied so long as he's dead? Yeah, I think, I think he'll be satisfied so long as he's dead. <laughs> Let's go get him. There's one way to find out. Right behind you. <laughs> okay. Kerry. Mass Effect Monday with Metroid Crime, where you learn massive amounts of material about maladies. Tune in every day <laughs> to smart enough and support our gal crime all at the same time. Amazing. Oh, motherfucker, no! God damn it! I'm fucked. Okay. Okay, I thought it was gonna kick me out. Did I miss? Oh, no, here it is. Two and three. This looks interesting. Okay. Shepard, I have patched into the warehouse scanners. The crates in the transport carriers overhead are rigged to explode when dropped. Oh, fuck. Good to know. Why don't you just start Headed for combat. <laughs> Firing a high impact shot! Well, you must have tried systems, where it is established within a media and a symbiotic relationship. Legionella bacteria survive in water as intracellular parasites of water blowing protozoa, such as a Plumberry muffin. Should burn nicely. You also learned that the shepherd fired little Rosie's father out oh of an God. airlock at the just as Rosie was passing the viewing room and ran to get a glimpse of the nearby planet. She saw her fork of car floating by. Dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Whoa. This should punch through their armor. The pause, yeah, it was great. Don't drop that on me. Okay. Who are you fighting? Oh, motherfucker. Oh, they're just dropping their necks. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. My shields are down. Right in the face. Stop moving. Can't aim if you're moving. <laughs> Plumberry muffin. Dead. Metroid. Dead. Frozen. Frozen stiff. His eyes. 
burst, little droplets of blood spewing from the empty sockets. Oh my god. Poor Rosie never got over it. Dead. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, that's awful. Oh, I wanted that ammo for W there. enter mute. Oh, there we go. She can do it. She's the best. Metroid Prime will pass the test. <laughs> She can do it. She's our lady. She will triumph. I think. Maybe. Oh, M-E-T-R-O-I-D. C-R-I-M-E. That's she. Crime, you'll do it. We believe your victories are guaranteed. <laughs> That's such a good chance. I love it so much. Let's heal. Let's also do this, maybe. Oh, it recharged. Duck. Heal squad. Nice. Get this other one. And now we're out. What are you doing now? Oh, no, right. Please stop. <laughs> Love that goose stealing lightsaber. Yeah, it was really good. It was pretty funny. Kerry. Now little Rosie, who is slowly dying of legionellosis, will have nothing to think of but the horrible spectacle of her father's imploding body as her lungs fill with fluid, she coughs up blood, and burns with fever. Plumberry Muffin. Rosie had a little pet duck once, until the shepherd saw the you cute little close. fluffy ducky Not waddling close. along the hall one day. The shepherd snatched the poor little thing up, tossed it into an oven, and dined on roast so duck with some rosemary. Fade. Rosemary, to add salt to the wound. Huh? Come on, Garrus. We can work this out. What do you need? Thank you guys for the lore. <laughs> it was very good. I'm looking for someone. How about well, I made a goose poop? Have something the goose other poop one emote. Oh boy. Red is <gasps> goose poop. <sighs> I'll have to see that. Check that out. Ouch. That had a hurt. Maybe you should just tell us what we want to know. Maybe. I still haven't heard what you want. You helped a friend of mine disappear. Did I miss a, a, a I renegade option there? I might need a little more information than that. His name I wasn't was paying Sidonis. attention, I was reading Tori chat. Came from the... I know who he is. W I'm not telling you squat. I looked it up. The girl with the lightsaber was the seventh sister from Star Wars Rebels. Oh, I haven't seen that yet. Ah, uh, got it. Is this information really worth all the trouble? I don't give out client information. It's bad for business. <laughs> you know what else is bad for business? A broken neck. Uh, yeah, it's pretty bad for business. All right, all right. Get off me. Plumberry muffin. <laughs> the little ducky was called Dennis, by the way. <sighs> Dennis Ducky Duckington, the first you, huh? and <laughs> last. No, you wiped out the entire so line of Duckingtons that day. Eyes. Damn. Now arrange that's me. Grim. Going. That out my outfit's ass pads are some berry muffin. It gets worse. Oh no. Yeah, it's me. There's a chance your identity may be compromised. That's why I'm calling. I'm sending an agent. Where do you want to meet? All right, he'll be there. Don't worry. I got it covered. It's all good. He wants to meet you in front of Orbital Lounge, middle of the day. 
So if our business is done, I'll be going. Kerry, I don't think so. A broken neck is you're good for business now, if you're Harker. an American so insurance what? provider. This is gonna kill me. W and <laughs> I tune in for the MCU law. MCU lore is very good. Kill you. No. But I don't mind slowing you down a little. No. <laughs> Maybe get CC the blood trail. There we go. Follow. I wasn't gonna choose the Bastard. paragon option there. Fuck that. You're lucky. I wouldn't have shot you in the leg. Fuck yeah. What I ever do to you? Sidonis better be there. Or I'm coming back to Didn't finish the Didn't Garrett say he, was gonna, he wasn't, wasn't going to be satisfied until he's dead? Harkin's a bloody menace. We shouldn't have just let Carrie, him go. He deserved to I be I wouldn't have punished. shot you in the leg. I would have shot you in the little toe. Plumberry Muffin. Rosie only found out when she went in search of poor Dennis Ducky Duckington the first, and when she finally found Dennis Ducky Duckington the first, all that was left was one tiny little leg, its foot barely holding it upright. A tiny, tiny, tiny <laughs> little ducky leg, no body. A bloodied stump. Poor Dennis Ducky Duckington the first. Rip was only a duckling, too. Rip. <laughs> Oh my god. Now I feel really bad. Why did I do that? Why am I such a horrible person? <laughs> Don't waste your time on him. Let's see sec deal with him now. Plumberry yeah, muffin. Right. <laughs> he was Thanks tasty. Oh, okay. Short. Well, that makes sense. W enter mute. R.I.P. Rest in pieces. Rest in pieces. Have you thought this through? You know what you're doing? No, but I'm not turning back now. It's not too late. You don't have to go through with this. Who's going to bring Sidonis to justice if I don't? Nobody else knows what he's done. Nobody else cares. I don't see any other options. <sighs> Plumberry Muffin. Well, talk to him. And so was Rosie want, when the shepherd got mind. a third for human flesh care. and roasted the poor child. He screwed Why? Us. He Why, dear Duck? Die. I mean, Dusk. <laughs> Why, dear duck? I mean, does. I understand what you're going through, but do you really want to kill him? I appreciate your concern, but I'm not you. This isn't you either. Really? I've always hated injustice. Kerry, I thought that Sidonis you should feel bad. Dennis Ducky Duckington, the first Duke of Ducktown, had a long life races. ahead of him. I'm Only sorry, five to ten years, to but long for a duck nonetheless. I can get a clear shot Long from Long for a there. duck nonetheless, five to ten years. Plumberry muffin. Quack. What do you need me to do? Keep him talking and don't get in my way. I'll let you know when he's in my sights. Give me a signal so I know you're ready, and I'll take the shot. You better go. He'll be here soon. Okay. Morton just sitting in the back seat. I forgot he was here. <laughs> Awkwardly sitting in the back seat. Shepard, can you hear me? What is going on with this like effect that's happening right now? Okay, that was weird. All right, there he is. Wave him over and keep him talking. <laughs> Chilling third wheel and Max and relaxing, acting all cool, shooting some b-ball outside the school. <laughs> Let's get this over with. You're in my shot. Move w enter mute. Effect. Uh, Is it a mass effect effect? This won't take long at all. You want a Harkins man? I don't remember seeing you before. That's it. Just keep him talking a few more seconds. I was told Harkin was one of the best. This better not happen again. Shit. Oh, it won't. Don't worry. What? Renegade. Shit. Betrayal repaid, Sidonis. Mission over. Okay. 
I wonder what the other... That was easy enough. This is what happens when you let things get personal. I need to know this is over. Yeah, it's over. I can move on. Glad to hear it. Thanks for helping me, Shepard. Let's no get problem, moving. Gary. I need to get away from this place. Right with you. I really wonder what would have happened had I chosen the other option. I'm sure I've chosen it every other time. I don't remember. I have to watch a YouTube video Carrie, about it. Why was he just waddling away? How did he expect to escape moving slower than Dennis Ducky Duckington, the first Duke of Ducktown? I know, right? W enter mute. Back to the loving arms of pansexual Kelly. Yeah. Imagine if that guy decided to jog instead of walk like an idiot. <laughs> uh, uh, let's go back to the Normandy. Undock. <laughs> Better die a few feet to the left. <laughs> Casual walk away. There's some things I need to check here. Um, also, my throat made a weird noise. I don't know if the, can the microphone picked that up. It was super weird. <gasps> I still w have my dress on. Man, Holy shit. Casual walk jam. Private terminal. <laughs> Thanks, Kelly. Your old kid's doing okay, everything's taken care of legally, and he's doing some work for me, helping me deal with some trash and awards, made me make life better for some of the kids. Like, Mouse, not perfect, but then what is? Uh, I don't know if your drill and mine are talking. I told him life was too short not to, but I don't know if it took. Good luck out there. Bailey. Oh, that was nice. I am so happy I still have this dress on, by the way. <laughs> it's kind of the best. Hey, Callie. How may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Oh. Anything else, Commander? Okay, That'll be all. Bye. Good luck out there, Shepard. Your necklace is fucking sweet, too. Man. Like this, like, w pattern on the mute. back? Three cheers for Cleavage Dress 9001. Hip hip hooray! <laughs> hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Yeah, you could probably put pockets in this. Let's, um, let's go check my fish. I hope Kelly has been actually feeding them. Yeah, I'm gonna feed them again. Feed them myself. This hamster is never gonna not be scared of me. Man, fucking space hamsters. Okay, the other thing I wanted to check was... I see, I see. Let's go back here. The only little black dress I have isn't really a skin tight type. It also has pockets right on the boobs, which is odd. Yeah, that is weird. Um, I have like a dress. Actually, no, it's not. It's like up to my neck, but it's like leather with like zippers like everywhere. It's fucking sweet. Love that dress. That might be the only black dress I own. And warmer pockets. <laughs> okay, hold on. Where am I? Where's the thing? Yeah, here it is. Research terminal. Ship enhancements. I still don't have everything. Oh, I do have enough for this. I need that med bay upgrade, though. How much is that? Well, platinum. I need this before I do the final mission, I think. Wait, what was that that it was? Because I'm not going to spend that. Platinum, okay. Fuck, that's also platinum. This is all- well, oh, not all of it. Yeah. 
SSGKOU003. She too lazy to feed her own fish, so she <laughs> pays them to feed them that way. Shepherd was shaking down people for money. Yeah, all makes sense now. <laughs> he needed to pay someone <laughs> to feed my fish, so I had to do crime. All the upgrades I can here without spending platinum. Kerry. Is that why Kelly ISNT dating you? Cause it's weird to date a boss who's forcing you to feed her fish. Yeah, a little bit. I ended up at the bottom there. Okay. That's platinum. That's platinum. See that? Platinum, platinum. Shepard, how can I help? I'll let you work. We'll be um, here. Um, I need to both talk to Garrus and I need to talk to uh Thane. W enter mute. Don't make her mad or she'll feed your fish to bigger fish or visiting Japanese dignitaries who like sushi. <laughs> Kerry. Also, those fish have perfect view yeah, of your whole room. Good. It's awkward to feed them and then have them watch you fuck your captain. <laughs> Very true. <laughs> Save. And let's go, uh... So the collectors did take New Canton? Yes, but my wife and daughter left in the nick of time. They're resting in San Francisco as we speak. That's great news. It is, but I knew a lot of good people in New Canton. Our mission has to succeed. Thank God Shepard's in command. I was never there. Do you need something? Uh... Have a few minutes to talk? If you wish. The last time we talked, you started speaking about a past event as if you were watching it. Drell have perfect memories. I've already seen this. any moment in our lives with perfect clarity. It's difficult to control at times. Right? Some of us disappear into, you know, let's call it solipsism. What do you mean, solipsism? When a memory feels as real as life, it's as valid as life. Thinking about a moment brings back the smell of cut grass, the warmth of another's hand on yours, the taste of another's tongue in your mouth. Wouldn't you rather lose yourself in such a memory than spend the night alone, staring at walls and metal and plastic? Isn't there a risk that you could lose yourself in bad memories as well? Of course. Remembering the times I've taken bullets is... unpleasant. But I can look at my knee and see it's not shattered. The memories that are hard to escape are those of despair. Isn't that a rather personal memory to talk about? Forgive me. Lately I've spent a great deal of time reviewing my life. I didn't mean to make you uncomfortable. You can remember everything that happened in your life? Nearly. I expect if we remembered the birth trauma, we'd never recover from it. You can relive every assassination you've ever made? In perfect detail. Every mistake I made. Every target's last breath. You don't seem to feel guilty. Why should I? My employers killed them. My body was only the tool they used. If you kill a man with your gun, do you hold the gun responsible? My gun can't decide right from wrong. You clearly do. My soul does. But my body is merely flesh. Flesh whose reflexes were honed to kill. Drell minds are different from humans. We see our body as a vessel, and accept that it is not always under our control. Convenient. So if I shot you dead right now, a Drell court wouldn't convict me? You'd be guilty because you chose to shoot me. If my reflexes caused me to draw and fire when I saw your gun come up, I would be innocent. Humans often believe in a soul distinct from the body. 
a spirit responsible for moral reasoning that lives on after the body's death. Our belief is just a bit more literal. The last time we talked, you remembered one of your assassinations. Something about sunset-colored eyes? Ah, uh, that time. Laser dot trembles on the skull. Spice on the spring wind. Sunset eyes, defiant in the scope. A bystander noticed my spotting laser and threw herself between me and the target. She couldn't see me, but she stared me down. It was odd that you just blurted that out. Just another vivid Drell memory? Not... no. She was a vivid person. Did you take the shot? Not that day. Mm. It was odd that you just blurted that out. Not... no. Okay. She was a vivid is, person. Is that the end of that conversation? Back to my okay, bye! Shepard. I appreciate these chats we have. You've spent a lot of your life alone, Thane. <laughs> Work fulfilled me. Reading. I barely spoke to anyone outside my family. It seems there will be no one to mourn me when I die. You're the only friend I've made in ten years. I'm not romancing Thane. If I had any complaint about you, it would be the occasional bout of self-pity. Like that one just now. It's clear my conversation skills have atrophied. I won't keep you. Shit, was that the dick move? Oops. Bye, Thane. Thanks for the weird talk. See ya. How can I help you, Commander? Right? Do you have everything? Absolutely. You need? Since you set up my kitchen, I won't take any more. Back to work. Let's go say hi to Space Kitty. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Sure. Just killing time, anyway. I what, wanted to thank you again for your help with Sedonis. Holy shit. Whatever happens with the Collectors or the Reapers or whoever else comes after us. I know you'll get the job done. You actually think we'll find something worse than collectors or reapers? I like to expect the worst. There's a small chance I'll be pleasantly surprised. I couldn't do this without you, Garrus. Sure you could. Not as stylishly, of course. It's strange going into a suicide mission on a human ship. Your people don't prepare for high-risk operations the way Turians do. I thought you'd be used to high-risk operations on human ships. I mean, think about trekking Saren to Ilos. Sure, but that was quick. We raced out, landed, blew up some geth, and saved the galaxy. This time we've got Miranda and Cerberus Carrie. and that AI. Why, why, why cross <laughs> those legs go? I think I preferred blind optimism. Is that it? Honestly, Garrus, what do you think our chances are? Honestly? Oh, no, okay. The collectors killed you once, and all were the same piss you as before. off. I can't imagine they'll stop you this time. But an unmapped area, advanced technology, and the collectors. We're going to lose people. No way around that. Not a happy analysis, I know. Don't worry. I won't spread it around. And I'm with you regardless. Do you ever regret leaving CSEC or the Turian military? Not Kerry. for a minute. When if there are one thing, I'm glad for it that the eye tracker ISNT tracking me. When a good Turian hears a bad order, he follows it. He might complain, uh -huh. but he knows his place. I just don't see the point in staying Well, I was curious how it was life. rendering. Not when the galaxy is at stake. How do Turian crews get ready for high-risk missions? With violence, usually. Turian ships have more operational discipline than your alliance, but fewer personal restrictions. Our commanders run us tight, and they know we need to blow off steam. Turian ships have training rooms for exercise, combat sims, even full contact sparring. Whatever lets people work off stress. You mean Turian <laughs> ships have crewmen fighting each other before a mission? It's supervised, of course. Nobody's going to risk an injury that interferes with the mission, and it's a good way to settle grudges. No, amicably. so okay. I, I was wondering. <laughs> we were about to hit a battery. If she was wearing like squad. shorts or something Very underneath. Risky. Because you could this see from across the room, at each other's it was at a bad nerves, angle. Mostly, she said. Yeah, I looked. We settled it in the ring. 
I assume you took her down gently? Actually, she and I were the top-ranked hand-to-hand specialists on the ship. I have reach, but she had flexibility. It was brutal. After nine rounds, the judge called it a draw. There were a lot of unhappy betters in the training room. We uh, ended up holding a tiebreaker in her quarters. I had Doubly reach, to mute. She had of course he looked. More than one way to work off stress, I guess. Is this the, the Garrus romance option? I did save right before this. It sounds like you're carrying some tension. Maybe I can oh, help shit, you. Shit, my fucking legs that. just went through that box. I uh, didn't think you'd feel like sparring, Commander. You know me, I'm always up for hitting things. Double you enter me. It makes you feel better. Watching the magenta blob <sighs> magnetized to that I'd space. I'd rather not add my name to the list of people you've knocked on their asses. Thanks for coming by, Shepard. And don't worry about me. Whatever. That happens, wasn't the romance option. There. You had to do uh not renegade, I think, there. Please stop flashing us, Shepard. I'm pretty sure you can come back at any time between now and the end of game and do that part. The romance option. I don't know how to do Kelly's romance thing. W enter mute. Are you trying to romance Space Kitty? That's not what I meant was a romance pass. Yeah, I, I assume so too. I wasn't sure if both options worked. Um... I don't know. Can I? Ro I don't know if I can romance multiple people. You probably can, right? I don't know if it. But I also like I saved right before I talked to him too. Oh, I have a save file for that. It's save. <laughs> save fifty nine. Yeah, I'm not sure either. I feel like I should look this up before the next stream. I'm starting to unlock all the romance stuff. You can pursue multiple people and eventually have to make a choice. So it'll cut off all conversation options. So I can't figure out how to romance Kelly. No, she never has any commander. new things to say to me. How may I help you, Commander? Do you have a moment to talk? I always Only have time one at a time, you, Commander. Oh, man, okay. Thank you, the menace. I better go. Okay. Maybe we'll talk later. So I have to- I actually have to make a choice. Oh, man. Damn it. Yeah, the first- the first time I played this- the first two times I played this, I didn't really anyone. Enter mute. <laughs> All hail cleavage dress 9001. <laughs> I love this dress. It's fucking sweet. Kelly, please, this isn't working out. You're not adding anything to the relationship. We're the only one putting in any work. <laughs> about not fucking your coworkers and mute. focus on the mission. You know why that specific number? <laughs> Good point. Good point. Why that specific number? Oh my god. I got kicked in the fucking hand today and it fucking sucks. I feel like my finger needs to like snap or like crack w or something. Mute. Because the cleavage is over 9,000. It's very good. <laughs> uh, mostly fine, but oh man, that hurts. It's just this one finger and it sucks because I had it like in a fist. Like I was closing, I was, it was in the middle of, oh, I had it in a fist. I was in the middle of opening it. Oh, opening it. Opening it. And the kid like kicked me in the fucking hand, wrist. No. Finger. Most of the time it doesn't hurt, but then like I, every once in a while I'll hit a button and I'll notice it and I'll be like, ow. Leave orbit. We're gonna go, um, do we need fuel? Yeah, we can buy some probes, probably. It feels better in the morning. Yeah, me too. Samara will be next, so let's go over here. W enter mute. Reminds me of my right index finger I messed up on the wave bird playing Luigi's Mansion. Oh boy, what what did you have to do to <laughs> in Luigi's Mansion? 
I didn't play that game. Okay, we're gonna hit exit here. Okay. And we're going to save right here. And we're gonna go back to the main menu. Hey, 